everyone, I hope you're all having a lovely day. So, I'm gonna teach you on how to set up scenes inside of Wagdo. Now, in case you don't know, you can actually set up different kinds of scenes for your VTuber avatar or multiple different characters inside Wagdo. So, let's say for one scene, you want to be outside and you have a certain type of mocap solution for it. Or maybe, uh, let's say you have, um, you are in like a sauna, you know, you're in a nice relaxing area or something like that. Or maybe you're in like a disco party or maybe um you're in like a sort of like grocery store with your character and such you can basically have multiple different kinds of scenes um and have like different kinds of settings for it of course you can still do it within one project but um maybe that could be a bit too tedious so maybe having multiple scenes will be really beneficial for you so we're gonna show you uh how to do that so of course you can go ahead and add new scene if you wish uh so if you want to make a new scene you can go ahead and type the name out and such um you can even open a pre-existing scene here as well too so any scenes that you have made you can definitely you could definitely like uh, name them however you want and such and they'll even let you know um, how old the scenes are basically. And then you can of course save your scenes or save it as a different name basically. So there's that. Do keep in mind Wadudo does not auto save, at least to my knowledge they do not auto save your scenes. So if by any chance you exit out of Wadudo and you're wondering why your settings did not save, it is because you did not go here, click on the little paw at the bottom left and then click on save scene or save scene as. Um, so please make sure you do that before you leave Wadado. You can even reload scenes or restart scene if by any chance you're doing a lot of debugging or something bad happened to your tracking or something like that and you need to reset Wadado without leaving the program. You can definitely utilize these things as well. If by any chance you are reporting to the dev, um, by the way, uh, regarding any issues um, with Wadudo and such, and you have to send like logs or anything like that, you go here, um, you can open the, the, open the data folder that shows you like your assets and stuff that you could put into Wadudo. But otherwise the logs here, this is what you sent to the developer, by the way, just wanted to let you know. There's also Steam Workshop here, um, so if by any chance um, you wanted to get some assets there, for your scenes you can definitely do that and then of course we got settings light mode help and then even the discourse over here and all that stuff basically and just to quickly also show you things as well uh you can have your general things uh just to quickly show you here um you can have your output um you can set set up your you know your resolution for your graphics and all that and you can even set up your accounts here basically so yeah uh just to quickly show you in a nutshell the little um little settings thing here basically or just your scenes overall uh but that should pretty much hopefully help you out regarding how to set up multiple different kinds of scenes again they're all done in here um you could you also need to make sure you save because if by any chance you lose your settings then that's the reason why um, but otherwise, uh, if you have any other questions, please join the Wadido Discord server. Um, you are free to ask me questions or ask for any tutorial requests. Uh, but otherwise, I highly recommend joining the Wadido Discord server as the dev is very active there and they are answering questions. And also, you can even request new features there as well. There's a lot that's going to be coming to Wadido, so do check it out. Uh, but I hope you have a lovely day and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!